name is Marenia. I am a dance teacher. I teach contemporary dance and floor work. And today I will do with you warm up on the standing position. Everything will happen on the standing position. We need a little bit more clear, like we need space to clean up, to have a little bit more uh, room to move from one side to another. But it's doable in your room, in your home, don't worry. As well, if you could have uh, the really comfortable uh, clothes like sweatpants or leggings, that would be great too. And yes, prepare a little bit of water and drink as we go. If you have to drink, drink water, of course. And yes, let's start it our warm-up class. Let's stay on a little bit wilder position than our hip it is. And let's just start feeling our groove with our connection with the ground. What I meant by that, bend a little bit your knees and just switch your uh, weight from one side to another using your knees, using your feet. Your feet are the, the one which actually make you change the movement from one side to another. You're taking away energy from the ground and your feet feeling this energy and they are just start moving from one side to another, from one side to another. And the energy is going through feet, ankles, knees, to pelvis, to spine, to your neck, and to your head. Nothing is stopping. Everything is moving. It's not that you are moving only from one side to another. This task is just like main mobility in your spine. You can keep going as, as you want to keep going with this exercise, but as we go, I will just show you how you can develop this kind of idea with different uh, movements. And yeah, we are just pushing from one side to another. And now we are just focusing on our hands, which they are really relaxed. They are not doing anything extra. They are just following the wave which we are introduce them from our movement. We are not doing any extra movement from our hands. They are just following. They are just following. And our hands start to be bigger. Like they, you can, you can actually see how if, in more relaxed your hands are, they will more flying around your body. And let's do eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And now let's switch. Let's let our hand and the same time ankle turn in. Let's hand and ankle turn in. We are pushing our hand in. Our hand in. And another side. And another side. And another side. Poof. It's still relaxed. The really easy turn in doesn't doesn't do much. Like we not we don't need to push. We are not pushing. We are just following as the motion wanna go. And one side. And another. And one. And, two. and we still, our knees are bent. We really feel connection with the ground. We don't want to be high with this exercise. We are really low. We really want to take from the ground. And one side, and another. One side, and let's do one, eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. And let's change our exercise. Let's go the same direction, but now our elbow is going up, 
tapping the pelvis and down. I will turn around and show you this uh, from your perspective. We're taking our right side, we are going in our shoulder blades, everything is going in. We are taking our elbow, it's taking a lead and it's doing the big circle around. Our elbow touching our hip on the right side and now our elbow changing the spot with the with uh, hand and hand it's where the elbow was making a circle and come back to the natural and now we're doing the same on the left side in elbow doing the big circle elbow touching the hip change with hand hand is continue going into the circle and turning around behind and drop to the natural position and again right side and in circle touch hand big circle drop natural and big circle touch hand drop natural and again pam 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 and and a little faster one two three and four one two three and four and let's do that four times on right and four times on left and one Two, three, four. One, 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 two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. One, two, three. For last time, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's do that one more time when I am uh, front of you. And one, two, and go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Last time, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Excellent. After this exercise, when we finish this one, we are going to do a shot, like throw away our right, like throw away our left hand and left knee at the same time into diagonal line, which is straight line between our fingers and our toe, our heel it's a straight line and we're changing position our left leg is going in we rotate into the first and changing position right hand and right leg shut out and we're changing position through the first position shut down out and change position and when we shoot down lay out our hand and leg we are not doing this our head is really straightforward our shoulder is in and we just want to send as much as we can our energy through fingertips and through our heel it's this and come back and shot and come back and breathe Come back and back and come back and out and come back and out and come back. Let's do eight more and four on left, four on right, and let's uh, change the exercise on the next one. And one, two, three, go. Boom and come back. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we're coming back. We open our legs. And from here, 
When we finish here, we run away, open our legs to the second, and we want to go to the towards the right side. Curve. We're falling down, and our left hand, right hand, sorry, taking us up. Open to the standing X, and we're going again towards the right side. Curve. Open the right hand, and again. One and two, three and four and maybe you can see what I'm doing with my back here I'm not doing this everything is tucked in everything is tucked in and I am not falling down here tuck in and up and up let's do another side your left And open and close and open and let's do four times on right side four times on left side and three and four like your line are really long and another side it's long 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 and curve long 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 Long, 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 and curve, and straight, long, long hands, last time, long, long hands, not, we're not doing this, our shoulders going down, all right, from here, what we're doing now, we're taking our hands, our middle finger, it's a leader of this movement, we are trying as much, as we can extend our body and touch, we try from this spot where are we now touch both of the walls without moving our hands and the same thing is we try as much as we can touch our head into the ceiling and we try ah, and now we're going down and when we're going down we're doing curve and up, open your paws to the ceiling. And down, curve, close, paws going towards your, uh, towards your in, and your head going towards to the curve. And then open, out. And in, and out. And in, and out. And one, and out. And two, and one. And and faster one and one and one and and one and one and one and one and now we are bending our left leg your left leg and we when we bending our leg we going down and up straight and another leg down and up straight down up and down and up and up and up and down and up down and faster and one and two and one and two and one and two and one and two one and two and four more one and two and three and four okay let it go let it go let it go just make your hands loose your pelvis loose and we are just standing on a little bit wilder position and let's jump from one side to another but when we jump in really small little jumps like they're not they are not crazy they're not crazy jumps really feel i don't want you to stand up towards the ceiling i want to feel you really condensed position bend your knees take energy from the floor and just shift your weight from side to side one and two and one and two and one and two and one and two and when we are doing this we are changing position towards the right side 
and we are jumping from one leg to another. And now, with the same movement, we are just going into the orbit. Towards the side, towards the right side. And let's go. One, and two, and one, and two, and one, and two, and one, and two. And let's change the side. And left side. We, your le right leg is on the front. And let's go into the orbit. And one, two, and push away from the floor. Push, 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 push. And one more time. And let's go to the orbit. Bam, 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 bam. And another side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, let it go, let it go. Just your knees are bouncing, bouncing, bouncing. Bouncing, 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 bouncing. Okay, let it go. Now we're going on your right side of the room. I hope you're warm. Let's go on the right side of our room and we will do a little bit of our circulation movement which we uh, start doing the orbit. One, we are going on the right side of the room. Imagine that you're in your hand you have a hammer. Maybe, no hammer, axe. Yeah, that's the one. You have an axe in your hand and now it's the motion uh, how you want to just rotate your axe from the right side you bend your knee when you're doing it from right side to left side above your head and then going towards the right side again and you really want to feel that this axe it's really heavy and you really need to chop this wood it's above your head and drop. And when we're doing it, I don't want to see that your chest is going out. Your chest is in. And, and bend your knee. We're bending our knees. The chest and the spine, it's following the movement. Our shoulders are not in, like they are not tied in. Close, close, closer shoulder blades. And and another side when we do from the right to left another side from the left to right 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 and we are not stopping our movement our movement we are not um, stuck we are moving with our hands. We are moving with our hands. And that's the, that's the, what hands is doing. What our legs will, will do is like circle, 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 circle. With a hammer, <laughs> X, sorry. We are going circle, 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 chop, circle, 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 chop, circle, circle, chop. And when we finish our chop, we want to be towards, like on the straight line. We don't want to finish here or there. We just want to be as we're standing. Let's do again, start from the right side and our hands are so heavy that they are changing our position it's not from the legs the arms are chopping our make us turn our arms make us turn let's try to go faster and one and two and let's try to stay low we're not going we're turning, we're not going up and down. We are touching, our, our old feet touching the floor and our knees are bent. And let's do four more times each side. One, let's start from your right, right leg. And 
left leg as the first will do step into the turn and pump Thank you for dancing with me.